this so in today's video I'm here to share with you guys this unit that I am rocking right now so if you guys are interested then definitely go ahead and stay tuned okay Diva so before we jump right into the video I did want to let you guys know that this video is being brought to you guys by Sam's Beauty so thank you so much Sam's Beauty for sponsoring this video I greatly appreciate it but yeah Divas, without further ado if you guys are interested in the details and the specs on the unit that I'm rocking today then definitely go ahead and stay tuned okay Diva so jumping right in today we have the unit by Sensational. This is from their Wet Lace collection. I have her in the style Reina in the color number one. So this is the curly unit from this line. And as you guys can see, she is so beautiful. She reminds me of some type of wave texture version hair. So here is the cap construction. It is big hair friendly. It does come with two combs in the front as well as the comb in the back with the adjustable straps. This unit is also a 13 by 6 parting area. Now I will tell you guys that the lace is soft but it is very ashy so you will have to make sure you go in and tint it which is something that I did not secure completely which you guys will see at the end of the video. But yeah here is the hairline as well which looks absolutely impeccable. I love it. So here's how the unit looks straight onto my head and on me this unit falls at about maybe a 26 inch. I'm not sure. I'm just guesstimating because it does not specify on the packaging or anything. So now I'm going to go in and show you guys the parting area and girl look at that hairline. It is so beautiful. Now I know why they call it wet lace besides the fact that it is ashy but yeah this this is pretty but i just you know you have to go in and tint this especially if you're chocolatey like me now i am gonna go in and make this unit work for myself i did go in and add mousse but that's because i just i added mousse to the rest of the hair so that's why i wanted to go in and add mousse there but you definitely don't have to do that this parting lays flat i am using this but do not use this if you want your edges to be un or your baby hairs on your lace wig to be unclockable because she will like she'll clock out early like so don't use this i don't know i was just experimenting but definitely don't use that it's definitely not good for your lace wigs but anyways i'm gonna go in and finish making this unit work for me the best way that i can besides my little light parts that i left but yeah i'll go ahead and finish out my closing part Okay Divas, so now that you guys have seen all the details and the specs on this hair, I am here to tell you guys how I feel about it, so let's just jump right in. Okay Divas, so let's go ahead and start off with the pros, because you guys know I like to start off with positivity, so... Um, I really am blown away and very impressed with this wig. Like, girl, do you see how far back this parting goes? How perfect the parting is? How it lays? And I didn't even have to add mousse, to be honest, but I was just adding it because I added it to the rest of the hair. And I wanted everything to kind of fall together. But it's so easy to, like, switch the part. So if you wanted to, like, immediately switch it, you could. And I really do like that. Like, that is amazing. So the cap construction is nice. As you guys can see, the hairline is super duper nice. And this wig is just so freaking bomb. Like, oh my gosh. Like, I really do like it. The baby hairs are, like, super perfect. Like, everything, like, the hairline, everything about this hair is nice. Also, um, I did not run my fingers through it besides when I was, like, putting the mousse on. I did not experience a lot of shedding and tangling. I did experience a little bit, but nothing that was too excessive. I also really like the fact that this hair is very soft, so um, it has, like, a human hair type of feel, and it also has, like, that human hair type of look, which I really do like because, of course, you guys know, I'm always looking for something that looks, like, very, you know, like, that looks very human-esque. Um, but it's not like having a super high luster or anything like that and this wig definitely does not do that and it just really like it's so soft and I just love it like it's just so freaking pretty like you guys this hairline and this hair is just gorgeous I also really love the length on me it's about like I don't know how long this is on me maybe like a 24 to 26 inch and I am 5'2 um it might be a little longer than that I'm just guesstimating because it does not specify on the stock car but yeah I really do like this wig like I am like super blown away by it um and I do have only one con with this unit but divas I really 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 highly suggest you get this wig because this is like the most natural synthetic wig that I have seen like from the cap construction to the hairline to the parting space the versatility the feel of this hair feels very human-esque and it's just 
it's just so perfect. So I would definitely recommend it. I know we're not at the end yet, but I would definitely recommend it. But let me go ahead and tell you the one con that I have. I feel like with this unit, the only con that I have is the color of the lace. The color of the lace is like so, 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 so light. I am used to it being light and I always have to tint it like with my finishing powder. But this one is like super light. So um, you would definitely have to make sure that you go in and tint your lace or make it, you know, of course, make it the color of your skin tone because the lace is super light and it is very like ashy. So the lace is like very, very transparent. However, that is my only complaint, which is an easy fix. All you do is add your foundation, concealer or powder, however you like to tint your lace and you're good to go. But that was a con for me. I'm just like... Like, it doesn't need to be that ashy looking. But yeah, divas, that is pretty much it. That's how I feel. If you guys are interested in this unit, I will definitely have a link down in the description box below. So be sure to go ahead and check that out. But yeah, divas, thank you guys so much for taking your time to watch this video. I really appreciate it. If you fabulous girls did enjoy this video or find it very helpful and easy to follow, then definitely go ahead and give me a thumbs up. Be sure to go ahead and leave me a comment down below as well. I would love to communicate with you divas and know what you guys are thinking. And be sure to go ahead and subscribe if you haven't done so already and also hit that notification bell girl because I do upload quite often and you definitely do not want to miss any of my videos but yeah divas thank you guys so so much for watching I greatly appreciate it and I'll see you gorgeous girls in my next video bye